my dear brothers and sisters, in today's gospel, we can see that there are so many ways God communicates to us. And we have to learn how to pay attention to details. Now we read in the gospel, that was how Simon was called. But before Simon was called, Jesus preached the word of God. And while he was preaching, people were listening to him. And when Jesus saw that people were listening to him, especially Simon, and he told Simon, now put your net on the other side. And Simon said, we have told all night, but because you have said it, I will do it. Obedience to the word of God. And God communicates to us every day. When we come to church and we read the gospel, that is God speaking to us directly. So for those of us that say, oh, I don't, how can God talk to me? How can God speak to me? God speaks to us every day. But we have to pay attention to details. We have to learn how to listen and to obey his words. Like I said, today he is telling us to obey obedience, obedience to the word of God. Obedience to authority. We saw when Simon obeyed Jesus and did what he told him to do, he caught so many fish. Even though he toyed the previous night and nothing was caught, he did not say, oh, I'm so tired. He did not say, oh, I have heard so much about you. I don't need to do anything. But he said, but because you have said so, I will do it. And he did it, and he caught so many fish. So my dear friends in Christ, let us pray today that God will give us the grace to always listen to him and put his words in action. Simon listened and was able to put the word of Jesus in action. That was why he caught so many fish. That was why it was done on him that Jesus had a mission for him. Likewise, each and every one of us, that is a mission that God has for us. But we can understand his mission when we obey his words and put his words into actions. And he speaks to us every day. So let us learn how to obey him. We have to obey him because he is our Lord and Savior. We have to obey him because we trust in him. He can never mislead us.